Fear has officially announced a new dynamic driver earphone. This is their JD7. It's out. Um, look, another product from Fio. Fio these days, they're pumping out a lot of products. Um, it's coming with uh, a semi open design. It's coming with a semi open design. It's featuring a 10 millimeter dynamic driver with an internal and external magnet circuit setup that 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 pretty much improves uh, um, the density and also even improves uh, the way you you kind of like listen to your replays in general so it's a it's a built it's a well-built earphone generally few knows how to make earphones that's that's one of their staple of all their productions they 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 have quality builders uh in in the, in, in the factories they they know how to make earphones and they even make the fanciest earphones you can purchase for the price so they are saying this earphone is going to have deep bass um I, i've not seen like the the graph per se uh maybe graphs from maybe reviewers um the, the graph they are presenting shows that there is an elevation in the base region uh, and it can have a lot of um impact if that is the case if that is the way they tuned it uh it may be so that maybe maybe it, it, it could really be a base head um so but if if you listen to what they're saying that they're, they're, they're saying that that even with the graph they're, they're still targeting a Harman curve uh, tuning for for the earphone so if they are going with Harman uh that target this is going to still be a neutral earphone as well and i'm not a fan of Harman target i don't like Harman tuning generally i i just feel that Harman is not going to give me enough of enjoyment because they they scoop out uh, a lot of uh, that low end uh, from the, the hammer and target to make it slightly too neutral for my liking so i'm not always a fan of hammer and targets as if that is exactly what they put in with this jd7 but uh i don't know i don't know it could really be a good set uh it could really be a good set i know many people that that really love Harman targets um Harman tuned earphones that uh it's pretty much their thing they, they just love that Harman tuning in general so it look the product really looks nice it's very well built uh it's very well built and has um a, a, a fantastic a look to it so I, I think it should be pleasing to a lot of purchasers a lot of uh, users in general that would like to to own it it has a 32 ohm uh, impedance it has a 108 decibels of sensitivity it also has a max power input of 100 milliwatts uh, it uses MMCX connectors and that is the staple for few products they, they just love they just love their mmcx uh, and it's really built from stainless steel that's the the, the 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 build quality in a nutshell so it's very resident to wear and peer from what the company is saying uh only time will tell whether this thing would perform really well because i'm not a huge fan of hammer tuning in general but it seems like that's where they're heading to with this new product uh it, only time will tell only time will tell how well it performs in general so i'm gonna drop details even where you can purchase if you're interested in it so do subscribe to the channel do like our content i'll see you guys very much